Okay, so let's say you're a spy or even an overly protective dad and you wanna know when somebody leaves their room, but you don't wanna get caught setting up some camera in the hallway or something that can be seen, but you wanna be able to see the action right through the walls. Is that possible? Well, I'm gonna show you that it is possible with the technology that's available to everybody. This is pretty amazing, actually. So I'm going to be showing you how you can get motion detection that sees through solid walls and even solid concrete. Okay, so to understand how this is working, first you have to understand that different wavelengths of electromagnetic waves can penetrate different objects. For example, we all know that visible light penetrates glass. But as you can see here, using my infrared camera, you can see that infrared light doesn't penetrate glass. So using a device called a Wallabot costs about $80 and a smartphone, I'm gonna be showing you how you can reach James Bond status in your espionage. Bond. James Bond. So before I show you how to commit espionage with this, let me show you what it's meant to be used for. So the Wallabot uses radio frequency which can penetrate walls and even concrete, and it senses what's behind it and then shows it as an image on your phone. So I believe this is one of the first 3D radio frequency imaging devices available to the public. For example, if you want to see if there's a pipe behind your wall, all you do is bring it near it, and here's the pipe. Turn it sideways. Even with something that's not metal, it can sense that it's there. <laughs> it's calling it a pipe or a wire because <laughs> it doesn't think there's an arm behind the wall. <laughs> so basically, it's able to see right through this board here and see my arm behind it. If you turn it to this expert mode, you can see more of the actual data that it's seeing. <laughs> this is awesome. Even if, I'm, I, even if I move my arm back, so this is back about six inches, you can still see it. Now this is cool and everything, but a basic stud finder or a magnet can find you things behind the wall. But what about through solid concrete or even granite? Let's try that out. Okay, so this is about an inch and a half of solid granite. So watch how it can easily sense my hand when it goes under the granite. <laughs> so cool. So it's basically just seeing right through the granite and can see my hand underneath. It doesn't have to be a hand or anything warm either, it can be a wooden spoon. Okay, so how do you combine this technology to get motion detection? Well, it's pretty simple with how smart smartphones are nowadays. So I'm just gonna use an app called Alfred. And basically what this is, it's just an app that you can put on your smartphone that turns your camera into a security camera that can even do motion detection. So combining this Alfred app using a phone that's using this RF technology to see through the wall, basically you can get motion detection through a wall, even through solid concrete. Okay, now combining this all together, so let's say in a certain hotel room, you wanna know when somebody walks by a wall in there, but you can't risk getting caught setting up any cameras anywhere. So you rent the hotel room next to them and you set up this device. So let's see if we can set up a system of motion detection through a hotel wall and see if I can actually get alerted when somebody walks by a wall in the alternate hotel room. Okay, let's set it up. Okay, so first let's set up the phone with the Wallabot. Okay, now let's start my motion detector camera. Okay, so I have motion detection turned on here, so if it sees anything show up here, then I'll get a notification on my other phone. Okay, let's see if it works. Okay, I'll be there in one minute. I just have to walk by this wall first. No one will ever know. <laughs> Okay, my notification just popped up here. Oh, and there it is. You can see movement behind there. <laughs> That's awesome. Even if this were a concrete wall, you'd be able to tell if somebody passed close by it on the other side, and then you'd get notified on some device. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did and you're not subscribed yet, remember to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell to be notified when my latest video's out. And if you have any questions or comments about this video or any suggestions for me in the future, be sure to leave me a comment in the comment section. And thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.